That's got to go down as careless driving, Martin. Today is a rather special day, ladies and gentlemen, because we are playing the worst Formula One game there ever was. Uh, uh, apparently. Formula 1 at 98. I've scoured through the internet and uh, apparently this one is shocking and that's surprising because Formula 1 97 was a very well received game with some really wacky out there kind of cheat codes and things like that. But yeah, we're delving into another retro Formula 1 game on this channel. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Pause. Pause for a sec. Straight off the bat, okay, what I'm seeing here is Doctor Who vibes? Anyone getting that? You know, this is the intro, you know, this is where they play the music, the, the TARDIS be flying down the middle. Am I wrong? <laughs> this really is a game from 1998. This is giving me such strong 90s vibes. Under official license. I would hope so. I would hope so, mate. Using Vizor's technology. Apparently, it looked more like out of a part of a trailer for Viva Vendetta. What's going on here? What's with the really mysterious music as well? Oh, I, I just can tell already. We're going to have a lot of fun with this. Enough of the weird mysterious music. Now we're getting into the proper stuff. Here we go. It's actually quite... I, I always love the intros. The, the intros to these retro games are just something else compared to what we get now. Ooh, you know what? I rate this, you know. This is this is pretty saucy. Monaco tunnel. The vibe of this intro is like a summer rom-com <laughs> like trailer. And then, oh, beauty. What a logo. Lovely. This game is telling me it's loading the main menu. This, this is going to be a long day. Oh, my goodness me. What is this menu style? I'm ready to the music, you know. I like it, you know. It's like a little, it reminds me of Wii music. Oh, there's a little, ooh, there was a drum chime in there as well. Okay. Let's see what play options we've got. One player, two, two players. Okay, I'm guessing uh, local two players, maybe. Plus, one player plus link. What What does that mean? Who, who are we linking? Select driver and team. Yes, let's have a look. <laughs> <laughs> what are these 3D models? Oh no. Oh no. This, you know what this looks like? This looks like if you try to describe a Formula 1 car to someone in Scriblio. <laughs> It's the same sort of shape. Right, so we've got David Coulthard and the McLaren. Do we not get his teammate? No. We've got Esteban Turio, and the logo is a lot worse. That it, did McLaren pay for higher definition logos on the top left compared to Minardi? Eddie Irvine, oh, what a cool dude! Eddie Irvine in the Ferrari. What are those tires, man? Oh, Johnny Herbert. What? Why does he look like he's coming for us? He wants to beat us up, mate. Ah, change driver is down. John Lacey. Okay, okay. Now I'm getting it. So Eddie Irvine, Michael Schumacher. Love. Right, Williams. We've got Frenson and, 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 and Williams driver one. <laughs> what? What's happened here? Why? Huh? Who was driving for Williams in 98? Are you telling me that they couldn't get the license for Vionne? <laughs> We've just, we have to drive. We simply have to drive as the Williams driver one. It's like player one. It's like our little in joke, but they've already made it for us. Driver, I want to know driver info. Driver Williams one, outer Mongolian. You know what? What is what is this? Who is this driver? Birth date twenty eighth of January nineteen seventy three. Home of Monaco. But he's outer Mongolian, apparently. Height, 1.68 meters. Marital, <laughs> marital status. Why is this on the F1 game? Why, what did they get? They had 33 starts, 13 poles, 11 wins. Amazing. Amazing. I still don't know who they are. From what I've seen of this game online, people say it's very lackluster. There's a lot to be desired. And you know what? I can see that from, from here right now. Where are we? How are we? Oh my god. This... What is going on? What is this? What are the heads up display? This is the worst font I've ever... Oh no! <laughs> Look at that front wing flying! Oh no! I've gone backwards into turn one. How... Oh, the textures have stopped loading. Can I spin this round? Thank you. How do I change camera? I don't like this camera. Oh... Oh, here we go. Come on. Is there caught? I've lost my front wing. Oh, well, this is Murray Walker. Hello, oh, Murray. Yes, lads. Ah! And it's back to normal racing conditions as the green flag is 
<laughs> no, it's not, Murray. I'm in the gravel. Okay, this is T-Cam in 1998. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. My word, F1 games has got... Games in general have come through a long way. Oh, dear. Was that my... Was that me getting engine failure? There must have been a crash ahead. The drivers must slow down. Oh, oh, beautiful Apex. The drivers must slow down. Oh, this is not... This, that's not going to get annoying. I'm going to hear Murray saying, the drivers must slow down about 500 times now because I can't slow down because I've got no wing. Engine sounds, you know what? Not too bad. Oh, dearie me. Oh, I've lost my wheel. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Turn. No, I'm turning left and I can't turn. Go straight. Go straight. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I'm sorry. Come on. We can do this. We can finish a lap on three wheels. Okay. Channel or inner Michael Schumacher at Spa. Oh, uh, how is it? <laughs> How has the handling gone better with three wheels? It's actually better. I'm actually driving better with three wheels. <laughs> I found the solution. Just lose a tire and the handling improves vastly on this Williams. George Russell, I've got an idea for the next Grand Prix, lad. Oh, beautiful Apex. I'm actually no joke. Oh, apart from this, okay, apart from that, I was driving so much better with three wheels on my wagon. Come on, building the power. And we're going up to second gear. And the, <laughs> oh, the checkered flag's fallen. I, I finished one lap and that was my race. And I can't even really do that because I'm having troubles at the end. Oh, fantastic debut, lads. Oh, ready for the big time I am. So, Mika Hakkinen and Michael Schumacher won in two in that race. No surprise there, really. But uh, this is what we're really wanting to look at here. Williams, driver one, plus two laps. Sounds about right. Right, we're going to arcade mode this time because I want to choose my circuits. Let's have a look at what we've got here. Interlagos. Looking very flat, very 2D, but I guess that's the nature of games in 1998. I'm going to move away from Williams Driver 1. I've had enough of whoever he is. And I'm going to go for Mick Ackerman. Oh! As we made the bend, I'm in a McLaren now, so I'm actually good at what I'm doing. And I'm actually leading the race. Monaco, though, here. This is interesting. Where are we going? Where is Mi Is this Mirabeau? Oh! Oh, we nearly did a Rosberg. Oh, avoid that. Oh, here's the hairpin. Oh, beauty! Oh, we're actually bowling along. Ah! Who would have thought we actually picked a good car? Would actually do well. All right, Monaco Tunnel. Here we go, baby. Oh, look at the shading. Oh, beautiful. And out the tunnel, the glare, the sun glare. There, there's no sun glare. There's no sun glare at all. But where are we? Where? Wait, where, where is the undulation? Oh, I got caught up in the wall. Okay, so this, uh, the, the tracks don't have any ele elevation whatsoever. They're all just flat. I want to go to Sao Paulo just to test that theory. Swing pool. Interesting. I've lost the lead to... I don't know who I've lost the lead to because there's no ladder. There's no... Oh, no. Oh, what has happened here? What has happened here? Come on. Come on. Here we go. Right, catching up. Right. Murray. Murray Walker, where are you, mate? Where are you in your time of need? We need to know what... Time extended... I didn't know. Wait, 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 wait. Are we playing a time? Are we playing a time attack? Oh no! I just realised what's happening. We played an arcade race. They probably set this game up in an actual arcade, uh, an actual arcade. And so this was like a. Oh, you need to put in like one pound more to play. Oh, what a move, Danny! Did you see that? This is making a lot more sense now. If this was a game designed to also be played in an arcade machine, then it makes sense why it is horrendous as a home console game. Rascas. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the brake. Oh, the brakes overheated. Did you see that? That was quite cool. They're quite ahead of their time. There, we don't even have that on the. We don't even have that on the current F1 game. Brake disc glowing and locking the brakes as we slam them on too hard. And they got too hot. There's a lot of play in the braking. When you when you're braking, that you can really just turn the car quite vigorously. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't know what reverse is, and I can't reverse. You're gonna have to push me, mate. Yeah, push me. Push me this way. This way. No. Come on. Yeah. Okay. No. Okay. You can just accelerate to get out of the wall. That makes a lot of sense. And now my car's broken. My car, my car, my car doesn't sound healthy. My car is, my car is now stuck 
And I can't get out of this one. I can't, and I'm done. And, and I'm done. I, I'm done here. Okay, good. What does a replay look like? Okay, no, a replay is just a, a simple replay of this. And, and that's it. That's all you can do in this game. So, the best part of this game is the fact that Murray Walker commentates if you do a championship draw and free race. That is it. Look how excited he's out. You know, he's overtaken Yarlo Trilly. <laughs> it's great. It's great. Murray's the best part of this game. Move out the way. He fights past Verstappen. Play this game if you want to just hear Murray Walker doing his ting, doing it, living his best life, commentating F1. Because the rest of it is horrendous. The handling is abysmal. It's so difficult. It's so difficult. And I'm not just saying that, oh, because I, I'm so used to the model. Even just by 98 standards, I think this is a difficult handling to, 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 to master. And like I said, there's not much else to play. So, yeah. In conclusion, this is this probably is the worst F1 game. Or one of the worst F1 games ever made. Um, and I should have known that from, from the, the, the publisher name alone visual science but if you guys did enjoy this video and want to want to see some more retro f1 games then let me know what you want you want to see me play next in the comments below hit that like button if you aren't around here do get subscribed for weekly formal on content and uh i will leave you with murray walker goodbye i don't know if that spin was down to the car or just bad driving i think you're being a bit kind there martin it looked like he just pushed a bit too hard that's got to go down as careless driving martin